at home with Lucas here. So today we're going to be talking about a turntable, a cassette player, a Bluetooth set of speakers, and a recorder. Yes, a Bluetooth set of speakers, a turntable, a cassette player, and a recorder. You're getting where I'm going with this. It is an all-in-one, people. So in this video, we're doing a hands-on with the box, quick unboxing and first impressions on said turntable. After that, I'm gonna be putting this bad boy to the Atom Lucas test to figure out is it something you should buy or maybe skip altogether. I'm here for you, so I have to waste your time buying and returning. All right, let's go ahead and jump into it. Okay, let's go and walk around this thing real quick. So up at the top left here, you have the power and volume knob. It's a little bit um, gooey and strange when you turn this. It's not the best tactile feedback. And then there is a press right here, click button. Then you have your headphone jack right there. You have your source, this is where you can record. You can go through the different folders. Then you have a little display. Then over here you have your skip and next, play, pause, and stop. This is your auxiliary input. Then you have the ability to tune to get to your radio stations. This knob is also a little bit funky. And then it says that it records and plays MP3s. Down at the bottom over here you have your U standard USB. Then you have your SD card slot right there. Here you have your cassette tape slot where you can pop it out here. Then you have your speaker on the right side and a speaker on the left side. Up at the top here, you have your turntable. Let's go ahead and turn this thing on. So you press and hold for five seconds. Away it goes, it turns on. We can go through the different sources. So you got your Bluetooth, you got your auxiliary, you got your tape. And then you got your record, which is spinning up there. And then we're back to our stereo. That's AM, really FM. Forever. Back to Bluetooth there. And then you press and hold. Power's right back off. Okay, I'm gonna be pairing this up with my iPod mini right here this thing is packed full of some high-res audio files there we go tunable that was really simple let's see it pair up there it goes all right let's play some music Okay, that's max volume on the iPod and max volume on Tunable. All right, let's see if we can skip our Bluetooth device. I'm gonna hit next. Nice. Okay, so it definitely sounds like 
this thing is producing, eh, I would say decent sound quality. These speakers are definitely not the best out there. And for a device that is an all-in-one, meaning it comes with speakers, you're probably going to want to send out the audio to a pair of actual good speakers to really get a good sound quality. Um, and it sounds like this music is firing out on either side as it would be, and you're not really getting a lot from this direction here. So that's definitely a downfall. Okay, I've been using this thing for long enough that I think I have a full star rating for you guys. So this thing is decent. It's not the best out there. You're not buying some crazy premium device, but you're getting a bunch of things all in one. The cassette player was perfect. Everything I tested on it worked fine. The record player up here was very nice. Once again, you're not getting anything premium. You're not going to be blown away by any of this stuff, but you're getting all of this in one package. You get speakers on the side that are going to be decent, better than your smartphone but nothing to write home about. You're not gonna be blown away by the sound quality. You're definitely gonna want to purchase a different product if you want really good sound quality or you're gonna have to pipe out the audio. Um, all the SD card and USB worked perfectly. The radio was fine. Um, so all in all, I'm gonna give this thing a 3.8 star rating. I'm gonna say I recommend it um, as a gift for someone young who maybe wants to experience a bunch of stuff. But if you're buying this for an audiophile, you're going to want to skip this and go with something else. If you're an audiophile yourself and you're looking at this, definitely don't buy this and buy something else. Um, but solid star rating. It's a good piece of equipment. It's a good piece of tech. But it's just lacking in all of the, the ways that you would um, not want it to lack. So it's got all the features, just not at 10s. It's, it, they're all below 5s. Um, out of 10 so that's my full review full star rating on this thing um, buy it if I hadn't scared you off and uh, yeah bye all right there you go that's the digital now turntable hopefully you enjoyed this video if you did definitely click and clack that like button if you want to join the Adam Lucas family and you want to be a part of this crew hit that subscribe button every time I get a subscriber I get a boost to make more and more videos and it's because of you guys I surpassed 6k yes people on my way to 7k but I need your help yes you right there tell your friends tell your family this guy's on YouTube they should go subscribe and watch my channel but as always I thank you for watching each and every one of my videos and I will catch you in the next one bye bye